Hey guys, I wanna show you how to do a VLOOKUP with multiple criteria. And we're not actually gonna use the VLOOKUP formula. But uh, so essentially, if you so if you have a table like this and you wanna grab the price, but you wanna make sure that it matches San Francisco and North, right? Not just one. Then it's hard to do a VLOOKUP unless you, unless you use like a helper column. So this is the way that I wanna show you how to do it. So we're gonna use the query formula. So type query, and then you're gonna highlight the table that you're looking up to and then you're going to type quotation marks select the column that we want to return so select H where uh, F so this is the first criteria where F equals we want to have it equal whatever's in cell a3 in this case right so the way you do that to use a cell reference is three quotation marks the and sign the cell which is a3 closing and sign and the three quotation marks. So that's the first criteria. Then you're gonna type and the second criteria is G where G e equals, same thing, three quotation marks and sign. Now it's gonna be B3, closing and sign, three quotation marks. Now we're gonna close out the entire query formula with a quotation marks, one at the beginning with the end and the parentheses. Now when I press enter, it's going to show the number but also show the header, right? And the way that we get rid of that is after the last quotation mark, type in a comma and then zero. This means we want to show zero headers. Now you'll see that it pulls from this table whatever it has in column F, San Francisco, and in column G, North. And then make sure that you lock in your cell, ref your cell references so that it doesn't um, just, so when you drag it down that it's completely fine. So now that we have that, we can drag it all the way down and you'll see that everything is correct. So San Francisco South is 700, Los Angeles North is 400. Um, so that's basically how you do it. Make sure that the syntax is completely correct uh, the way that you type it here, especially like, you know, these things like the three quotation marks um, and then like using, like type it exactly like how I have it here. And if you wanted to add in a third criteria, it's really easy. You just keep on extending it and whatever column it is, you know, H equals whatever. Uh, so I'm going to leave this doc in the description below. If you want to just kind of um, open it up, go to file and make a copy. Don't request access, okay? Um, just go to file, make a copy, and then you can kind of play around with this formula and see how it works. All right, let me know if you guys have any questions. Thanks.